just minutes away. Now you may be wondering what's the best way to keep your home at a cozy temperature without your bill going through the roof. 8 News Now reporter Madison Kimbrough is live tonight and she has some expert tips on how to do just that. Hey Madison. Hey Ted, yeah, it is cold out here and for the viewers sitting comfortably at home, I'm sure they've seen an increase in their gas bill like the people I spoke to tonight who say it's been a struggle. We keep our thermostat at 72. Las Vegas locals feeling the cold as we approach December. We have noticed the drop in the temperature um, has made the bills go up uh, a decent amount. And with heating bills going up, many are left wondering how to deal with it, like Joyce and Fred Luckin, who live in North Las Vegas. We've seen quite a bit of a difference, like a couple hundred dollars. The way the electric bills kept going up and up and up like crazy. And we try to keep the thermostat down and they just keep going up. Luckily for them, their grandson is a senior technician with Bumble Breeze. It's hitting pretty hard right now. It went from being somewhat decent in temperatures and then doing a drastic drop. Wesley has received a bunch of calls for furnaces not blowing heat, and he shared with us some advice on how to maintain a warm house and not break the bank while doing it. Tip number one, keep the temperature between 68 and 72 degrees. My personal personal recommendations would be to keep it around 68 degrees at night um, and about 70, 72 during the day, and that should maximize your savings when it comes to your power bill. Tip number two, set it and forget it. When you're turning your system on and off, the initial startup is what draws the most power. Setting it and forgetting it in, in a long-term sense is going to save you more money when it comes to physical okay. temperature. And grab your filter to go ahead and remove it. And tip number three, change your air filters every two to three months during the winter season. If the system can't breathe, it can't perform. That causes stress. By changing that filter, it could help you save money on that power bill. And if you're lucky enough to have a fireplace that doesn't use gas, make sure to use it. Now, along with space heaters can be a portable and effective way to space or uh, target certain areas of your house. Reporting live, Madison Kimbrough, 8 News Now. And Madison, according to the National Energy Assistance uh, Directors Association, the average American household expected to pay anywhere from $787 to just over $2,000 in heating costs. That's between October and March.